have Paul Lee defending his crown against a list of who's who in terms of three-point snipers sa Liga po natin. Here we go, the first com competitor, Mamrik Anmisi from Barangay Ginebra. Well, remember, only three will advance to the next round as Anmisi is off to a relatively slow start after only draining one out of his six possible points so, in his first round. So, going for the set shot, no? The usual na jumper ni Mab Anmisi. A multiple winner sa uh, obstacle challenge, by the way. Two-time winner. Ito from way downtown, and uh, some guards like that. Si Anmisi has yet to really get going here. All he needs to do is at least qualify to the top three. Nakita nga natin kanina, itong si Raymond Almazan was actually tied for third with Dave Marcelo, and he ended up winning the whole competition. Right, right. Oh. The most difficult part is getting into the final round. And that takes away precious seconds here from Mav Ahan Misi. He only has 18 left to go through two racks. Here it is, Mav Ahan Misi. It's gut check time. He needs to drain this quickly. Four seconds to go. Can he put up a few more in? And that'll do it as Ahan Misi ran out of time, but he still finishes with 18. Big surprise that uh, Han Misi was not able to finish his final rank, but still a good score to open up the competition in the three-point shootout. Ulitin ko, mahirap yung first shooter, mahirap yung last shooter. And coach, no problem siya because he missed that one elbow three-pointer from 28 feet. Kasi saka ano, may nalampasan siya na rack, di ba? Yeah. We had to uh, go back and take the shot. Tapos, okay lang kung na-shoot mo eh. Exactly. Yung uh, 28 feet na set shot, yung single shot, that would have been worth three. And he actually had a good rhythm dito sa last track, pero ayun, ran Started out of time. Started slow, but uh, eventually picked up. 18 so far is our uh, running score here para kay uh, Mava and Missy. Uh, and here we have James Yap, multiple time three-point king. The hometown hero. Uh, with the Blackwater bossing, number 15, a whole new number, feels like a whole new world. <laughs> but for James Yap, let's see whether or not that stroke is still true with him with a new number. 2009-2018 title holder in this competition. Multiple PBA MVP as well, and uh, holds the record for most all-star appearances probably. Probably, yeah. I'm not sure. <laughs> and dami. Oh my, dami coach. And then to see James, yeah, coach, you can the form, yeah, it's almost signature, almost iconic. Sigurado ko nanonood dito ay si PJ Simon. Oo. Oh, oh. Nananalo na rin. Kaya ako inalap si Elaine Maliksi kasi siya yung champion ng 2017 when he played for the Star Hot Shots. And yeah, gets the money ball to go and Kaya almost misses. Kaya nila, oh. Wow. Oh, and that's big because that's worth three. Can still get to 20, no? Mm -hmm. James, no? When it going gets tough, James gets going. Uh, the giant hands of James, yeah. And that's big because he has a chance here to overtake. I, I first saw James playing for the UE Red Warriors. He needs this one. And that won't count anyway. 17. Just one shy of Mab Ahan Misi. James game, Yap. Big game James. Still a good showing for big game James. Still a good player at his age. Oh yeah, absolutely. Many decades in the PBA, no problem. Yes, it continues to be a big draw. And uh and layo niya, no? 28. Ni hindi to malun ng di bumuelo. The giant hands of James Yap. You can actually see it there. Just how nice how he to can watch. Handle the ball. Still very nice to watch the shooting for of James Yap. There's a reason why there are multitudes of Yapsters all over the world. Agree, agree. Fifty percent shooter from the three ball. So far, a bit of a slow start for him. Sets up his final ball. Still no good. 
16 seconds out of it lapsed. to rhythm shooter din to, saka mahilig ito off the dribble. Diba? Kasi point ang nilalaro. Well, let's see. Stockton, from way downtown, no good. And so far, bit of a struggle here for Stockton. Yes, hasn't gotten that streak that he wants. Multiple and consecutive. Everyone is made. forgetting that second set ball, coach. Yung uh, pakalawang 28 feet shot. Oh, but he makes it. And that's important because that keeps him in the race. And his money ball is coming up next. Money rack, rather, is coming up next. Still very much alive. Oh, and Stockton gets that to go. How many can he get here? From a defender to a uh, premium, premier guard for the Converge Fiber Xers. Their second leading scorer if not their top scorer. Well, with that, he outpaces both Maverick Anmis and James Yap. With 18, Yap had 17 a while ago. So, first three shooters started out slow until they picked up the next coming racks. So, Ken Tuffin also a dark horse in this competition, by the way. Let me take a look at this again. Nothing is easy in this competition. No, nothing is easy. As you see, the sun's starting to set here in the city of Smiles. So, kita natin yung sunlight from Sinasabi Kuyosa. ni Juan Mar sa sarili niya, sana the next year meron din ganyang bola. <laughs> sa big man. Para mga bawi rin siya. Yeah, I mean, yung ganyang kalayo. Yeah. Para madagdagan ng range ng mga bigs. Three shooters down. Stockton with a respectable 18. Also a PBA champion. 17 to qualify here. Paul D. Oh, he's starting to get going here. Parang nilalagay lang. That's a layup for him, Paul D. There's a reason why he was champ last time around. Unorthodox. But he gets it done. It almost comes from his chest. Coach. And his range is uh, unimaginable. You see? That shot was made for Paul Lee. And this is his money rack. Bago mag Steph Curry range, meron na ako nakikitang Paul D range sa UAP pa lang. And that's a big money ball there for Paul D. The three-pointer is good. And he's up to 18 already. Very hot. He is setting the pace. Setting the bar really high. Putting pressure on the rest of the competitors. Now uh, 23. Very comfortable stroking it. The last two racks, top of key, and then the right wing. And with a lot of time as well. Paul Lee trying to get 28. No, but 26 is more than enough. He is firmly in the lead. You can say that that is a ticket to a spot in the final round for Paul Lee at the bat. And right catch, now, catch me if you can. Ang tagline dito ni Paul Lee. <laughs> and then Raymond Almazan is like, yeah, you know, you can be a champion like me. You, we can uh, shoot out <laughs> next year or pag uwi sa Manila. Uh oh. Let's take a look at that again. Paul Lee, ang ganda ng simula ni Paul. He set the tone early and he set the tone in this entire competition. Look at the backspin, never wavers. And the form, the unorthodox stroke. Something that he has. Distinct and unique. Nakita mo yung speed eh, oh. Again, picture perfect. Paul Lee coming away with a big, big lead at the end. Or rather, at the middle of round one. I think that's very impressive about that stroke. His ability to get that ball loop. Yung art na nakukuha niya. Kasi mahirap yun dahil it involves a lot of uh, legs, really. To push that ball really high. Is sneak into the top yes. three and then let the chips Wag fall. Wag na si Paul Lee ang mo. Tignan mo na lang yung unang dalawang shooters muna. And that means you need 18 to qualify at the very least. But of course, if you make the 19, you we'll start here for Newsom. More breathing room. Newsom. Good flow. Getting it going. Almost splitting his uh, first two wraps. Gets the uh, important money ball. Shot from way downtown oh, nice. is good. 
All now up to nine points. Is money rack. Money ball, yes. So far, so good for New New. Much improved three point shooter, really. And this one shot could see him qualify. Yes! So he will move on, but what pace does he set here? Chasing Paul Lee. He cracks the 20 point mark, almost let go of that ball, but he makes it anyway. Chris Newsom putting Paul Lee on notice here. Now at 23. 25. 24. Now it's 25, coach. 26. And a chance to make it 28 with this last one. And he likes the buzzer beater. Well, 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 coach. Paul Lee has a challenger here in Chris Newsom. Excellent effort coming from Newsom. Sabi mo, not easy to shoot behind Paul Lee. But it got it done nonetheless. And all of a sudden, the pressure ramps up to the guy who's following Chris Newsom and Paul Lee. As Newsom. Pero dito hindi mo kasi masyado mapapansin. This is the final round. Mararamdaman mo talaga kasi kayo na lang eh. Tama ka, coach. As Newsom. Take a look at this. The final ball, the sidestep pa. Got into rhythm and waited for the buzzer beater. And he gets it. New New. With the exclamation point. With flair to finish. It's about putting on a show. And that boy put it on. Twenty-eight points by the Chris Newsom. This is a very streaky shooter, by the way. Yeah. But if Herndon gets a couple going, he can really change the game. Malaking bagay yung money ball rack, you know. Herndon could not get up to seven. Lusa made both, no? So he got six points from the two balls in Chris Newsom. It's Herndon. Just like Paul Lee. Parang kay Paul Lee, parang lay-up rin yun eh. Oops. Almost missed it. Oh, and that does not trickle in for Rob Herndon. Who will not be able to catch up to the likes of Newsom, but can still sneak into the top three. Kailangan ma-insaya mong yung uh, long ball na yun. Yung super long ball na yun, yung dalawa. So, a chance. material yun, six points yun eh. Tama ka, coach. But Burnham still has a chance to qualify. He needs to drain this and then drain the money ball. But that won't be enough. 17, just one short of cracking the top three. Still up Deliano. Still up Arvin Tolentino. Javi Gomez Deliano. Ken Safin. And a lot of guys here who Karapot. could, a lot of guys here, coach, who could still threaten the top three. Again, a lot of people. Talagang big time scorer, to a big time player, go to player, to. Oh, and he is enjoying his first shot, and he followed up with more. My favorite spot nito is sa ibabaw. Slowing it down a bit. Low and steady, Arvin Tolentino. That was a much improved second wrap. Moneyball does not go. He needs this one. Kita natin yung trend kanina. If you get your three-point balls to go. He's behind right now. After missing that very long ball. But still on track to potentially cracking the top three. You, know, you don't need to beat... Paul Lee or Chris Newsom now. You just need to get to in the be, conversation. To be better. Uh -huh. Doon sa mga nasa ilalim ng 28-point scorers. And Tolentino gets the money ball. So he still has a chance to crack the top three. One more should do it. Oh, and this is big. 
He needs this to go, and he gets it to fall. That's clutch. 19 for Arvin Tolentino. Safely ahead of the other shooters. Ah, medyo ma challenge dun ah. Wow, ako si Paul Chumachal stepping down. Dahil may nagbabantay dyan. Meron tayong mga officials na nakatingin kung stepping o legit o legal yung tira. Again, good start there for Paul Lee in the second round. And important buff buckets in the money ball. And Tolentino coach, all he has to do is try and sneak into the top three. Yes. But still so many big this names. This could have been a bigger score had he made at least one of those two yeah. super long balls. Went back to New Zealand when he returned, very ready for the PBA draft and really jumping out of the gate to make a big name for himself right in his very first season. Very unassuming to see Ken Tuffin, but here he is getting people to notice him after a good first rap. When he came back, he was a different player. Absolutely, coach. Grabbing improvement uh, both as a person and as a player. The way he handles himself on the floor. Tough in. Oh, that would have been big. Hard worker in more ways than one. Tough in. Oh, yeah. Again, only needs to go beyond 19 to qualify for the top three. This is going to be a big one. And that's no good. Here's his money wrap. Has to hit at this three. And unfortunately for Tuffin, that money rack has not been kind to him. As I say that though, he only needs two more to make it to 20. Don't need to rush. The important thing is you make your shots. And there it is. Can he get it? No. But he cracks the 20-point mark and is safely into the top three momentarily. So far, with some more excellent shooters lined up. Yeah, you just go down the list, coach. Gomez Del Llano, Caracot. Caracot. Calvin of Tana, Marshall Lasseter. No. <laughs> tough. Take a look at Tough and saying that you gotta mention my name amongst those next time because here he is, cracking the 20-point mark. Excellent long range shooters. Missed the super long balls, but was consistent on all the racks. Struggled sa kanyang money ball rack. And eventually, that rush of the fifth and final rack was impressive for Tuffin. Here's Andre Karakot coming up next. Again, you know, we want to see who can go out there and be the surprise package. Because we all have uh, at least your favorites not on paper. And the Karakut is not one of those favorites on paper. Under the radar, so to speak. Yes, sir. Can but also having his breakout horse. here for Rain or Shine. Gets his first and the money ball to go. That was important. Ito, early money ball. Ah, right, no? Maybe that could be important. Deepa siya pagod. Ooh. And that's in and out. Oh, that must have been painful. Long on that super long three. Still a chance here to... Super long ball, rather. Still a chance here to make it to 20. Oh, yeah. Needs to be a bit yeah, more accurate. Dito. Parang oh. ginawa kanina. The previous shooter natin. Ayun, no? That was an important rack there for Andre Carajo. Has to hit this one. No good there. You can still make it 20. And Andre Karakot trying to do so here. Still alive. And now needs to be perfect here to reach 21. And with that, oh, that miss that gets him out of the running. He ends up with 17. Good effort here from Andre Karakot. So far. They keep moving on to the final, so they keep playing. And uh, it, it all adds up. Marisho, off to a great start that here. That form is very, very difficult to copy and emulate. Mahirap, mahirap. Kakaiba eh. Naalala mo si Chris Lutz? Yes, Yung mga ganyan tira, ang hihirap niyan. Marisho. 
Feel the release. He needs this one. And not falling there. Can Marisho catch up here? He only needs to break the 20 point mark here. But so far, after a hot start, hasn't really panned out. And sometimes the hardest part is to get to the final round. To release the pressure has to make this one. No good yet. Layo, layo niyan, you know? Now needs to be perfect. Oh, and that might do it here for Marshall Lasseter. Struggled after the first impressive rack. And Marshall gets a money ball to fall now. Here's his money rack. And Super Marshall finishes with 17. But unfortunately, that will be just a step too short here. Right, right. So he gambled with that money rack as the last rack. Did that work for him? Brings in another national player. Calvin Aftana, also a very good trigger from the long ball. Another look at that here, Marshall Lasseter. Again, a great first rack. Excellent first rack. Slowed down in the second. Had a good third. Yung, ano eh, yung super long balls. Yeah. I that, thought that uh, affected his confidence leading to the fourth rack. Sabi nga niya that uh, maybe to win the three-point competition, kailangan may guwari daw siya. Yung iba kasi, mas, daw yung iba kasi oh. mas magaling sa ganun eh. Oh. Representing Terra Firma. Ito, streaky shooter to si, uh, si Javi. Javi Gomez de Leano, who actually had a stint in Japan before going to the PBA. Now, Gomez Eliano slowly making a name for himself here in the Liga. Natin. Trying to splash into the top three of this contest. So far, only two players have hit the super long balls consecutively. That is Pauli and Chris Newsom. Good flow here. But misses the last shot. Sila lang yun ang shot ng ano, no? super, super long. Ang dalawa. Gomez Eliano trying to catch up still and uh, will not be able to reach the... He needs to get this perfect to make it to the 20-point mark. Sabi ko nga sa'yo, streak ito eh. Can he keep the streak alive though? Oh, this one to qualify! And Gomez Eliano misses! Oh my, heartbreaking. Unfortunate end there for Javi Gomez de Liano. Just one the, point away. The parents of Javi Gomez de Liano. Traveling with Javi all the way here to Bacolod to lend support and celebrate the appearance of Javi. Sa ating, uh, amaya maglalaro si Javi, no? Sa, no, but check natin, it's Team Stalwarts. That's a Team Greats. Oo. Sama si the BGR, Ken Tuffin, for Team Greats. The Star Wars vs. Greats was the only appearance of Coach Richard Del Rosario as an All-Star. Di ba? Oh, oh. Oh. Alongside Willie Miller. Importante All-Star. Oh, nalala ko yun. So, Kevin of Tana trying to get to 20 as well to at least qualify to the top three. Former Red Lion. Okay. Ito rin, kailangan ito na may bantay. <laughs> And Aftana gets an important money ball to go. Now he needs this one. It's worth three. Can't get it. Hirap is shoot, ano? Si Paul Lee lang natin. Saka si Chris Newsom. Yeah, and si Newsom. But Paul Lee makes it look like a layup. But this is Kevin Aftana's spot. He picked this and he's making it all. And this is important. And he gets it all. That is 12 points. Back in the hunt. Ooh. But all he needs to do, coach, is reach 20. How far can he go? Can he get there? Oftana knocking on the door. And this is a power forward. And Moonlighting as a small forward. But now he's playing the three spot more here in the PBA. He needs just one. Now he needs two to make it clear. There he is. He is firmly in the top three. Oftana taking his time, padding it on. No. Will 22. That, will that be safe? Meron pa bang natitira? Oh, wala na. Wala na ata. So that means it will be Chris Newsom, Calvin Oftana, and the defending champion, Paul Lee, in our championship round. 